What's happening, Captain? This your boy CB Hunts. Yes, what you see before you is the Diamond Select. Disney's the Puppets, Hudson, and Beaker. Like I said in my last collection, uh, I've got all these off of a, a toy store. Even though some of the boxes had the more of the other boxes that you've seen in my other reviews, this one here, like they just they just had in the uh, original clam shell. But I always did like Bunts in the Beaker, and I know it all over, and all the other ones I've said like certain ones was my favorite. But actually, as I got older, it became my favorite. But my main one in the movies was actually. Was, a, was actually a speaker to the y'all make the little mother <laughs> like, so like he was a, actually my uh, favorite as a child but like, you see the packaging you see what all it comes with you see uh Ozzy and Kermit down at the bottom a couple of the people in the background got the uh up is right here and on the side of the box the show has a beaker, and quite nice. And on the back of the box, same thing. Has no bio. Like I said, I did get this one, and I do have, I do have animal, but I didn't, I didn't get the uh, old man in the balcony. I just didn't really want them, but I got everybody else. But trust me. As we get back, we will have these bad boys at the box, and we'll see what we do with uh, Hudson and Beaker. And now we got these bad boys at the box. Well, package. <laughs> you see what all they come with. I really do like these two figures. These figures are badass. I can't wait to have them all set up in, in like a, a little spot. I already got picked out for all of them, man, but before we talk about the figure, we can talk about everything that they, that they come with, basically most of everything is heading towards, heading towards Benson, because, I mean, not Benson, but Unson, but, you know, bigger than what really he do too much, he just stand there, go me, 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 and get, and get like, and get all the, uh, ex what's his name, in his face, explosions, so, <laughs> That was basically his job. But before we talk about them and everything that comes with come, come with these figures, you already see it. We got the infamous black stand for each one. They have no have no logo. Go right here. So they got one for Bunsen. And they got one for Beaker as well. Speaking of uh Bunsen, we're gonna talk about all the stuff that comes with him. This is basically a stirring ish for certain certain elements and stuff you can be able to do. So you can see it doesn't really move, but it holds it right in this spot. And the pole almost is burning a little stick. So got that there. And along with that, it has a I forgot what this is called. I, I, I just I just said auto. I forgot what it's actually actually called though. It's actual it's actual uh, scientific name for this this type type of a uh, bottle, but it, it has chemicals in it right at the bottom. I guess like this is like oh from the chemical or actually just the the bottle and this the stuff that's at the bottom. So that's what we got right there. And same thing for like Bunsen and Beaker type thing. This is one of them bottles that and device that holds the bottle, and it have it have like a little have like a little fire under it to kind of to have it to have these to, to to cook. But that's basically it right there. How it looks there. And quite nice. And we also, well, with all the chemicals too, it has this little rack that has a little uh, 
little uh, aisles as well. We got an empty hole if we want to like move around. I guess we can we can you actually take these out? No. No, they just have this empty holes in there. So let's see about that. Now that thing with Pussy. You always see him, you see him with. Is a clipboard. He does all his experiments. I guess this is one of his little devices he's he's actually working on. It's like a little like, oh, like old school clipboard. You see the little see the little silver pad that's the top hold up and hand up and the paper comes out. It's old school stuff there. Yeah. <laughs> But the one thing I was kind of surprised with these figures, but hey, I'm, 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 I'm happy to have because I could probably put this somewhere else. But I was kind of surprised they brought in an actual old school phone. So if you can't tell this was a phone, how it looked to you, how it looked back in the day, especially in the 80s. I think probably early 80s because we, we didn't have the uh, push button yet so he still was in the uh, order dial to see the number and you bring it all the way around and then click back all the way around put the phone another number click it go all the way around and then spin back all the way around basically because you get That's basically the sound, trust me. I hated that all <laughs> back in the day. But yeah, but that was basically it. But just hold the button, and turn it, it'll slide back on its own, do another one. So that's what it was. Now, before we get to a certain figure, one thing I want to say, like I said, the rest, the reason I got these is because they haven't really made any figures, and I'm hoping someone, someone will. Or I might buy the ones that's like like uh, or the new sh show, but get like certain uh, certain characters. I, I I know they have like the uh, who? puppet babies of them, but 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 how I liked them was like in the '80s that show there. But if you didn't know, the Muppet Baby cartoon was actually based off a certain movie. I can't remember the movie, but it's a couple of, a couple. Of, couple of clips right here where they he talked about his childhood and they showed this here and that sparked I guess to somebody who actually wanted to make this a cartoon show where I thought of it and did that I thank you because that was one of my favorite cartoons back in the day that I watched all the time I don't care if it was like reruns or whatever and that theme song man I can't play it I can't sing it because I don't want to get deep in you know, the copyright. If you go on YouTube, it's on there. It's like, it's, man, it's so good, man. But, before we get into the figures, we can go with uh, Bunsen first. The main man himself. Being quite nice. All oh, the head got no eyes. So, yeah, he didn't have no eyes. You got a little tie, a little suit under there. Has a little lab, his lab coat. It was quite nice. Got little pants at the bottom. Shoes, nice. The face, I'm talking about the face is spot on. All these things are spot on to the to, to the actual thing. And having them so small, you can probably get a whole mother, a whole bunch of them. Just put them on. on. One on the table and still have room for like more. That's why I kind of like these a lot. So I was thinking about probably probably when they get in the band. I don't know. So or and I might soon later get the get the old dudes as well because that that those uh, are um all the ones that I'm. That, that I'm missing so if I want to have the full show and probably shelf 
I'm, I'm, I'm talking about it, all of them now. I'm gonna go buy the whole collection, right? <laughs> so, so this is how it looks here. So, we bust him. We'll go with his articulation. You can look up a lot. Ooh, almost. Almost all his glasses. We look, we look up a lot. And we look down too much. Look left and right. Raise his arms up. So high. Single elbow. Move his elbow. Have no type of articulation hand, but can turn all the way around. No waist movements, but can't really you can lift the leg up just a little bit. Not much. But it does have articulation in the shoes. So feet that much. Not that much, it does have a little, a little bit of ankle. Hit it. So if you like the Muppets, trust me, this pack had to have a bunch. And now, this is for well, the main man himself, Beaker. Looking quite nice. I like the like his face. With his type of head, I, I know he can't do with the toy, but he would always stick his head down in his shirt, stick his head back out. I know uh, an actual person. It was a whole lot of movies back in the day. He used to do this same same thing. He'll stick his neck neck down and up. And I know he was in the the the, the uh, movie slash musical of the uh, of the uh, Robin Robin. He was Popeye, and he was also on Sesame Street and the Cosby Show. I can't think of his name. Hopefully, I can. I just found him right here, so I put in his name because that dude was a very talented actor, and I think he was part of the circus as well. So, but I'm like, I'm like Beaker, he's quite nice. Got his lab coat, got the green lab coat with his brown lab coat, green and shirt, pants. On the him with his leg, his leg a little. Loose, but I, I think I, I think I did that. Pulled him out the package, so I kind of got him loose. So hopefully he'll stand real well. I like his shoes though. Look my nice old school style shoes. They almost like clown shoes. Pants look clean. And has little socks. Now, like I said, these socks. It's also the same way how it was on the uh babies, but but much longer. It was on it was on a person called Nanny. You uh, you always see her from the from the uh, skirt down. I always heard her voice, but like never seen her face. You ain't lying. <laughs> but yeah, but we go Beaker right here. So with Beaker. We'll go with his articulation. Can't really move his neck back too much. A little bit forward, left and right. The way his shoulders are made, can't really lift his arms up too much. So it goes about right here. Oops, sorry about that, hit the camera. Right here. So he does have articulation in his elbows, but not really that much. So he got a little bit bigger. Turn the hands all the way around. No waist thing. Can't even can't really kick his leg up too much either. So he basically is left and right. Feet go down a lot. Go up a lot. He does have ankle rocker. So if he, if he got that punching, he always got to have speaker as well because of the M2 R duo. And this is my review of the Diamond Select Toys. Disney B B Muppets Bunsen and Beaker. Hope y'all enjoyed this review. Trust me, go ahead and find out how to it. And in every review, I will take pictures. This is my Instagram right here. Well, I will be links down below. You go and check those out. And the boys on TikTok. Well, I take those same pictures. I post over there. But I just add a little bit of flair. This is your boy CB Hunts. Hope you have a blessing. You trust me. I can't wait to. Catch you on that next one. Peace.